Not very many people really expected to see this happen so quickly the way that it has at the beginning of the year. And if you don't know who I am, I'm talking about the housing market. So my name is Christian Stubbs. I'm a team leader and owner here of Onyx Homes. And we were talking to so many people. And I just feel like the market updates that we send out once a month aren't even doing justice to just how quickly the market's really changing. So I'm going to dive into a couple of things today. But one major takeaway is just how quickly something can go from December being a slower market market where buyers were taking advantage of the market and getting great deals to January and even in February, almost every single offer that our team is writing is getting multiple offers. I've got some notes down here. So let's dive right into this newsletter. Now, if you've been following along to, with this newsletter or these updates for quite some time, you've been hearing about me talk about through the whole winter season that buyers are taking advantage of the market. And in the year prior, we were seeing a lot of different prices changing. And those are things that we're not seeing happen in this market. So if you haven't watched, I think it was two weeks ago, we did the market update for February. Upcoming, I have something totally different. So now that we are six weeks into the year, I can give you, or at least when I'm filming this, I can give you a little bit more context as to what we've really seen happen is that there was no flood of new homes coming to the market. There were actually less new listings to the market than there were last year in our market. And it's hilarious because I see all kinds of agents posting there were more listings this year than there were last year. And it's because they look at national numbers, they're not even looking at local numbers. So for Orange County, our market, there are about the same amount of listings as there were last year. So that's nothing's changed there. Inventory is still incredibly low. And buyers did exactly what they've been saying that they were going to do is they're going to wait till the beginning of the year to start their home search again. So what's the result when you add together not very many new listings coming to the market, not very many listings sitting active on the market, and all the buyers started shopping at the same time, bidding wars are back, buyers are doing crazy things. And yes, that is absolutely true. So in this video, I'm going to peel apart what's really happening, why it's happening, and and what is expected to come in the near future and in the extended future as well too. And what a lot of people aren't talking about is when the beginning of the year started, rates were closer to 6%, now they're over 7%. So even in this really short amount of time, buyers have been continuing to go into bidding wars going tens of thousands or even hundreds of thousands of dollars above list price. Obviously, the list price is all relevant as well too. If you're going $100,000 over on a multi-million dollar property, it's not nearly as significant. But we are seeing people going $100,000 dollars over asking price on a million dollar home. So these are significant bidding wars. And this isn't on every single property. This is something that is a little bit different than what we saw in 2021. And some of 22 was buyers are doing crazy things on all listings, no matter what. And right now, it is still apparent that if a house looks bad and is not priced right, it will still sit. But one thing is very clear, buyers are not really affected by interest rates going anywhere between six, seven and 8%. The market has proven that they don't really care that much. And if you're one of those buyers, yes, of course, you care about the payment. But the reality is the buyers that are actually closing on deals, it doesn't seem to have any impact on, on what they're really willing to do. And here's one thing is I have honestly been very proud of the fact that for the last two years, we have done a monthly market update every single month. I think I've missed one month the entire time. It was probably because I was sick and couldn't get in front of the camera, but I still wrote the update. Something I've been really proud of, and I really want to make sure that we are educating our clients, whether you use us or not as your real estate agents. I don't really care that much. To be honest, we see so so much going on in the marketplace, way more than a normal agent would, that we just have a very good bearing on what's happening in our local market. But like I started this video with, it doesn't feel like the monthly market updates are enough for right now. So what I have actually done is I'm going to go ahead and commit to doing what we're calling the state of the market address or event or whatever we're calling it, right? It's a state of the market. Now this is going to be a live event where normally in a market update, it'll be a 10 or 15 minute video. If it's really long, it might be 20 minutes where I'm talking about about very broad of what we're seeing in Orange County as the actual numbers in the housing market. Well, that doesn't really tell the whole story because a lot of the times the numbers are from the previous month. So the, the numbers are 45 days old, usually by the time somebody's seeing it. And in this case, the market's wildly different now than it was 45 days ago. So this state of the market event, the goal here is that it's going to be a longer live event. So if you have questions, and I know as a real estate agent, the number one question that I get when I'm out in the field, I'm at a family event, whatever it might be, is, hey, Christian, how's the market? That's what we're going to talk about. So I'll give you a brief background on our company in this. You're going to have a huge deep dive on the actual market update, what's really happening in our local market here at Orange County. We're going to talk about what we are doing to take advantage of that. And we're going to talk about next steps if you wanted to take any. So if you want to sign up for this, there's going to be a link or something down below or on the screen, wherever it might be. But go ahead and sign up for this. This is something that's going to be a live event. So if you have questions and you want to you go back 
back and forth on it. I'm going to be live in the chat there as well too, answering your questions. I am almost seven hours into making this presentation and I'm trying to condense everything that I know about what's going on into a really succinct presentation to just share the most important stuff, but really go deep and be real. Now, I'm not going to go through a million different numbers. I'm going to try to make this super clear for the people who aren't numbers people. I kind of am, but I'm going to try to make sure that this is as simple to understand as possible while still getting all the meat off the bones. Now, if this sounds interesting to you, make sure you sign up for it, even if you can't make the live event. I definitely would recommend coming live if you can, because we are going to be, a, you're going to be able to ask questions live as I'm talking about something. If you have a burning question, you can drop it in the chat. I will answer it. There's not going to be any questions for me that are, they're going to be off limits. So I'll go ahead and answer everything you can think of. And it's going to be for buyers. It's going to be for sellers. It's going to be for renters. It's going to be about the housing market. So if you have any interest in the housing market, whether you're thinking of moving or not, I'd highly recommend signing up. And frankly, so far this deal, we have closed over 40 deals and counting. So we have a very good idea of what's really happening in this market. We've written offers for a ton of different clients. And already this year, we've talked to thousands of people. You might be one of those who are thinking about making a move. So to say that we have a good bearing of what's going on in the market is might be an understatement. And again, I want to make sure that I make a point here is that this is not for big national numbers of things that you'll see on the news channels. This is for our local market here in Orange County. So if you're interested in all that, make sure you sign up and I will see you there. By the way, if you also have any friends you think would benefit from this as well too, please send this out to them. And if you're on YouTube, first of all, thank you for watching. But if you could like the video and subscribe to the channel, if you like this type of stuff, that would be great as well too. All right, my name is Christian. I appreciate you watching and I will see you at the live event.